side input of this, the, the B, the up special. And so, oh, we're going to town and city? Mr. E versus the duck again. And the dog. And the gunman. <laughs> I love this song. You know, I think, I, I think I'm rooting for Vaughn in this one. I really want to see them take it just because I want to see, you know, the local player win over... Oh, nice up. Mystery's local. Yeah, yeah, but Vaughn is more local. Does Long Island not count as our sixth borough? You know, I think... Depends who you ask. Yeah, it depends who you ask, and <laughs> I am not one of those players. Yeah. I would that, not that sounds like something someone from Queens might say. Are you from Queens? <laughs> no. no. I'm from California. He's, oh, He's also from around the block, which is actually really funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm two blocks away. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm my God. Wow. Yeah, you are local. You're the most local. Woo! We missed those texts. And Vaughn just looking so dominant versus Mr. E. Mr. E just unable to get in and stay in. Do you think it's like a matchup experience thing? It is because this is actually the first time the Mystery has actually ever fought Fawn in brackets. I was oh, checking really? PG stats and I was like, head to head players, I'm like, Fawn not found. I'm like, what? Whoa! So, well, this is the second time, technically. This is the second time they've ever had to face Fawn. And this yeah, let's see if they get the download, though. This is. Yeah, she's making it back. Yep. Ooh. I'm sorry, did you just say today's oh, the first no, time they've fought? Structured. Yeah, according to PG stats, I couldn't find a head to head. Oh, interesting. Yeah, now they're fighting again. Caliber of both of these players, insane. Unless PG Stats is lying to me. Unless PG Stats. Why would Panda ever lie to you? Panda has never okay. lied to me. <laughs> Panda has right. never lied to anybody okay. ever. Okay, alright. <laughs> That's a hot take. Panda did like. nothing wrong. Alright, okay. <laughs> I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. Sweats in Smash World Tour. <laughs> I didn't say it. Seven did. <laughs> Man, I missed that. I had some Smash World Tour points. Really? Yeah, I had a couple. Oh. I, I, I got, like, um, there was a pace tournament that I won. It had, like, 50 players. But yeah, Fawn's head to head comparisons, Mr. E, nothing. Zero, zero. Let, did you check the Smash data.gg? Check that one? No. Why don't you check that one? Yeah, but I'm, this, uh, one. But anyway, you know, this, this next kill. Yeah, this next kill here. Oh, gosh. Almost looking like a two frame there, but Fawn already looking really good. 10% extra credits. Not bad at all. And just racking that up little by little. This war of attrition, Mr. E is not winning. Up here? Nope. No, we're trying to get that mix up there with the back air. Uh, I, I think Fawn was trying to get him into the can. Fawn was, uh... Fawn was remembering the Smash 4 days and trying to channel Band out of there. Oh, here we go. And still no death. Yeah, town and city, really high ceilings. It's not going to kill at this point. Maybe the next one might. Oh! Uh, no, but a good trade. Oh. Both of them just flying to the corners. That's the that's the fawn signature move, I think. Get like immediately mash neutral B in like a. Whoa, like, that can't just flew! All right, almost caught Mister E. Mister E just has to. Where are they All going? Right, what do we see? Ooh, good magnet hands. Oh no way! If that? that killed Mister E. Yeah, that would have been crazy. Up here. That's it. Yeah, Mister E just right has there. to take that. Yeah. The, the fawn signature move get hit by you by the opponent and your can at the same time. Yeah, that they, is their signature move. They can take those trades. Looking like Snake out there, really. <laughs> but Duck Hunt is stupid light. Yeah, Duck but I mean, they, uh, really, like until 1:30. I mean, come on, yeah. they're it's, light, it's but they're not that light. That dog has been well fed. <laughs> you think Duck Hunt has an owner? Yeah, it's I the gun. It's the, the gunman, gunman off screen. Oh right, yeah, true. So I am Duck Hunt's owner. We are Duck Hunt's owner. Yes. All right, but looking with that, we're going back to we're going to Smashville. Yeah, we'll Much smaller stage, which is good for Mystery. Can actually get in here. Bond doesn't have a lot of space to actually set up these things, but if they do get stage control and Mystery is off stage, they can start setting up house right below this mono plant. And as we see here, we just have two places of harass Mr. E up on the top with the can, and then at the bottom here with the gunmen and the clay pigeons. It's gonna be a hard one. This is also where they lost their last set to Fawn. Ooh, trying to do the jump and dancing blade out of shields. Mr. E just shaking their head, being like, how do I get in? This is a puzzle that they're gonna have to fi figure out in real time. There's no coaching here. All they have is them versus Fawn. 
Yeah, I wonder what the play is for E picking this stage over any other stage. Because, like, the does Lucina like to kill off the top, or is she mostly like a side killer, you think? Usually a side killer, but she can get some good kills off the top if they, you know, try and juggle you with up airs. But it's not as consistent. Because, like, Town and Smash will both have very close side blast zones, but the stage itself is very low to the bottom mm -hmm. blast zone, so the top blast zone feels a little uh, bit higher as a result. Smashville's right? ledge to blast zone ratio is actually standard, but, like, obviously the stage itself is smaller. But, like, in, in terms of, like, from an edge guarding perspective, it is actually still standard. Okay. Yeah. yeah. We're talking ratios here, and I don't do math. So, Mr. <laughs> So what Mr. E is having a lot of trouble here is we've noticed this a lot in Bracket or if you watch Mr. E play anytime, their edge guarding is so good. But what Fawn is doing a lot of when they're trying to come off come back from off stage, they're throwing up the can and Mr. E is like, Well, I can't yeah. go out and edge guard because if not I'm gonna get punished for it. But finally finding that kill with the dolphin slash out of shield, and Fawn is just setting up camp again. Yeah, Lucina really excels at like messing up characters' recoveries who like to go high. Mm -hmm. And the thing about Duck Hunt is Duck Hunt loves to recover in that, like, lower quarter quadrant. Yeah, and Mystery like, knows how to yeah. handle that. You know, a Dolphin Slash, maybe challenging it with forward airs, some falling nares. Dolphin Slash being probably their signature. Yeah. But it's going to be difficult if Vaughn just keeps throwing out that can off stage. And one of the largest tools in Lucina's arsenal for, like, uh, edge guarding characters who are recovering low mm -hmm. is that counter. Yes. But guess what? Duck Hut doesn't have a hitbox on their upbeat. Right. And I don't think, does the can even activate the counter? A can does activate the counter, but you're not going to get much off of it. You're not going to get much off of it. Yeah, you got the up air. Oh, whoa. That was kind of, that was some nice geometry there. Almost dead. More like trigonometry. Like I said, I don't do math. I don't know what the difference is. Well, trigonometry is about angles like this, and geometry is... I don't know, man. I failed geometry. <laughs> <laughs> there it is, the signature move! Just oh. press neutral B. <laughs> it's frame one. It's and frame Mr. one! Mystery at 0%, Fawn at 113, needs to find this kill somehow. But again, that gunman, the can, can't get off! All right, trying to find the same kill that they had in the last set. It was the Dancing Blade at ledge right out of the Clay Pigeon. And you can mash it, but Fawn is ready this time. Caught by the surprise the first set, but it's only going to work once. Yeah, he's ledge guarding against Duck Hunt is, or ledge trapping, I should say, is looking a lot different than versus Raptor. No way. Is this going to kill off the top? Never mind. To the blast zone. They can still bring this back, but again, yeah. have to find an early kill. Yeah, good chunk of change on Mr. E2 right now. Right, 109. Oh, this okay. could be death. Nope. Oh, Ooh, what we attack. take those. What attack. Oh, but trying to shark. That's back here. Yeah, but a sour spot. Ooh, falling fast, Let's though. Shot. Avoiding Up it. Air. Just about. Okay, back to neutral. We think neutral. Nope. Yeah, but not with that can in play. That can is always in play. Even when you don't see it, it just appears. This could be it. Oh, SDI's out. Air dodge is back in. So frustrating. Every time they have the right play, the can just comes back. No way. Oh, Good follow. Whoa. That could have been it. All right, now Fawn's just going to try and get a grab. Maybe follow up with that can and does That's find it. that kill. 2-0 yeah. once more. Again. New Fawn demon bracket through. unlocked. New, new bracket demon, Jesus. Okay, let me look at the, the smash data head-to-head -head right now if I get reception in here, which I don't think I do. Eh, I'm on the Wi-Fi, but eh, yeah. I'm, not, I'm not getting it. By the way, just no, Fawn was playing so well, spacing mm -hmm. out, getting this can. The can was the real MVP here. Doesn't Fawn play Lucina or Marth? They have a Lucina, <laughs> so they know the matchup. But I would say most people playing this game at this point know the Lucina matchup. I know. She's so a very, very fundamental fundies. character. Yeah, she's fundies, dude. I was talking to someone earlier, they were like, oh, Mario is so funny. I was like, no, Mario is cheese. You know who's fundies? DK. DK, you need amazing fundies to play that character. Because I, you I are think any heavy food, character. Any heavies, yeah. Like, yo, Dumpling King, that dude, amazing fundies. Yeah. I mean, that guy is also very fun to play against. You you do feel frustrated at first because you're like, how? I'm getting